and that's how you create this awesome VHS effect. Obviously, you can mess around with those settings, as you can see, like this, the zoom of it, and obviously uh, all those other markers like that. So that one looks really, really tight. So we can just mess around with all the markers like this. That's basically how you create an awesome VHS effect. <laughs> What's up guys, my name is Alex, welcome back to a brand new video and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to create this awesome VHS effect and that's going to be really, really simple so I would say make sure to smash the like button down below and I would say let's get started. Now as you guys can see this is just a stock footage clip of a beach and we're going to make this from this really high quality recent shot video into a really old VHS uh, clip. So if you guys want to download the VHS package that I have ready for you guys including um, the, the black bars that you guys are gonna need and also the VHS effect Make sure to check out the description. There is a link to it. It's just for free I just put it up there so you guys can download it and use it as well So that's really awesome and you guys can go ahead and do that so let's get started with the video and what we're going to do first of all is we're going to drag in a black bars or you can just go ahead and, and, and go to Google and type in black bars uh, PNG. What we're going to do is we're going to create a new video track and we're going to put this one on top of it. Okay, so those are the black bars that we're going to use and basically what you can do is you can also move up uh, the beach clip a little bit. So let's say that you want to see a little bit more of the beach, uh, what you can do or, or the sea, what you can do is you can go to the event pan crop icon pretty straightforward and you can just go ahead and move this around, I would say, like this. So that looks really cool and that looks already very tight. So what we're going to do then, the next thing is we're going to stretch this for the entire clip. Then we're going to create a new video track as well. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and drag in the VHS uh, clip. This one, as you can see. That one looks really cool. We're going to delete the audio because we don't need that. Then what we're going to do is we're going to put this one on top of it. As you can see, very flashing and everything. But in order to make this, uh, in order to see through this, we're going to go ahead and click on the compositing mode icon and we're going to click on uh, screen, as you can see. Let's say that you want to ha don't want to have those VHS effects on top of the black bars. Just go ahead and drag the black bars track above it. And as you can see, it only happens on the C. As you can see, that one looks really cool. But what we're going to do then is we're going to add in a nice TV simulator. So we're going to go ahead and click on TV simulator, drag in the default one on top of the beach clip. And as you guys can see, this image looks really, really cool. And that's how you create this awesome VHS effect. Obviously, you can mess around with those settings. As you can see, like this, the zoom of it and obviously uh, all those other markers like that. We can just mess around with all the markers like this. And that's basically how you create an awesome VHS VHS effect guys it is that simple so I want to thank guys for watching thank you for the continuous support that's this video and I will see you guys tomorrow just Alex Halford